Wait, what was that? Yo, I see that too. What the hell is that? See what? I thought I heard something. What do you see? What is that? I don't know. Wait. I think I saw something move down there. Hello? We see all, we see you, come to the light, come to us. We've told them no multiple times, and they just keep coming and coming and coming. They will not take no for an answer. Just stay with me, stay with me. What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new Randonautica adventure. So, um, new adventure same old place not ex not the exact same forest that i was in in the last video that you guys saw um but there is this other one that we had multiple crazy experiences i had a crazy experience with brad i had a crazy experience with frank the last time we were here i don't know what the deal is i don't know what the hell's going on in this forest as well um but yeah i decided to come back here and run an intent using the randonautica app for those of you who have no idea what randonautica is it is basically this app that uses some sort of weird quantum physics um at least that's what we're told um we have a lot of odd experiences basically we use an intent with the app and it's supposed to bring us somewhere nearby on the map and there's supposed to be something related to our intention uh, for this one i decided to use the intent tom uh reason being is because we're looking for a, a person named Tom, apparently, who's trying to seek us out. We got that weird phone call, like you guys saw back in Florida, uh, from a person named Dan, um, and we don't know what the hell is going on. So you think that lantern and wax maybe have some sort of significance? I don't know. <laughs> I'm what? literally getting a call right now from Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico? Yeah. <laughs> That's ought to be interesting. That's funny. Hello? Hello. Yes. This is Dan. You might be familiar with me by now. Uh, not really. How the hell did you get this number? Don't worry about that. Just know that I can see you both right now. The f did you just say you could see us both? Where, where the f are you? Listen, don't worry about that. I have something to tell you. I want to tell you and warn you that these dangerous, there are dangerous people out here. Sarah Gay is not to be trusted. The fuck? I would know. I used to work for him. And I am just... Just... Listen. Okay. Uh... Are we in danger? Very much so. Don't trust anybody. Okay. I would and find Tom. The faster, the sooner, the better. Where the hell do I find Tom? Unfortunately, Frank has caught my cold. So I told him to just take the night off, get better a lot faster, and we'll probably see him in a couple of days. In the meanwhile, I am with Brad. He's kind of like behind the camera <laughs> right now, but you guys will see him in a moment. Um, Brad and I were here like a couple of months ago, I think. Yeah, yeah, we did some random. Yeah, work. we had a very weird experience here uh, trying to we basically chased down our stalker for the most part that's more or less what ended up happening but yeah. um apart from that we're gonna get this adventure started um i decided to run the intent while we got right in here first and it is telling us it is all the way down the trail and um yeah apart from that smash the like button as it really helps out the channel and uh, leave us your intentions for maybe future videos down in the comment section below or go and follow me on my social medias and i often ask you guys for them there as well and of course go and follow brad who decided to come out and get a little bit um you know poopy in his pants tonight along <laughs> with myself at least i'm not alone which is good yep. um but yeah let's get the adventure started a little bit dark out here that's for sure so last time 
we ended up coming here. There was like somebody here. So Frank and I ended up going uh, this way, which is kind of spooky. As you can see, there's a little trail that people traverse. You want to you wanna come with me and yeah, see if there's anything yeah, yeah. Honestly, down here? There is, the yeah, there, there is something that I definitely have to show you that's like down this specific path. Like there's this weird like witchcraft looking thing. Yeah, you know, no, I'm like, I see swear it. it's like... like yeah, it's kind of like some weird Blair Witch project type of thing. Well, it's a shame, like you said, uh, that Frank's sick, he gets better. Yeah, I'm sure he'll be fine. He said he wasn't feeling too bad, but I just kind of was like, I'm like, yo, we need you, like, you know, to get better <laughs> as yeah. fast as possible. Because, you know, Brad's not going to come down every single day because yeah. you live kind of far. But, yeah. Uh, yeah, so I'm like, yo, just take your vitamin C and your D's and your Z's and take some <laughs> Tylenols and just and stay in Z's. bed, okay? So... Um, yeah, so he's just kind of chilling right now. Okay. Whoa. So, last time we found a trail of blood, and it looks like it's still here. I guess? I don't know. Unless somebody just spilled Fruitopia at this point, I have no idea. <laughs> Alright, uh... Dude, there's something right there. You see that? Yeah. What that? I don't know. So the witchcraft thingy is like down there if you want to go yeah, see yeah. it. You'll you'll notice it. It's kind of like a like a like a T kind of thing. I don't know, it's really weird, but is it just straight down? Yeah, it's like right down there somewhere. There's like a broken fence. Okay. You'll kind of see it. So, I don't know if you want to... Well, I'll go check that out. I'm going to see what this thing is. Looks like a mixer. Call me if, you know, you're in danger for your life. Just try not to go too far because it does go down. So, just try to, like, watch out for the edge. Oh, okay, okay. Is it that far? Not really. You'll you'll know when to stop, trust me. Okay, I'll see it right away. It'll start going downhill. It'll be before that. Excellent. All right, yeah, yeah, I'll go check it out. Yeah, this thing's got, like, tape all over it. What the heck? That thing was, like, frozen in. Okay, this might be a little hard with just one hand, but oh, look, I think we got it. What the hell? <laughs> what is this? Oh, all right, guys. So we have uh, run into a little bit of an issue with this video. Um, small, minor issue. Uh, nothing too crazy, but I did kind of have to add these segments in just to make sure that this video had enough context for you to understand what the hell is going on. Otherwise, you guys might be a little bit confused. So, basically what happened was I started editing this video, realizing that we had some sort of weird audio malfunction. Basically, what I think happened was the actual cable uh, from the shotgun mic probably wasn't in all the way or somehow popped out um, at certain parts throughout this video, hence the reason why we're doing this. So, um, basically I am going to more or less explain what it is that happened. I've never had this issue occur before. This was the very first time and it is very unfortunate, but we're very fortunate that the parts that are missing are not too long. Um, so yeah, here goes nothing. So basically up until this point, uh, we had obviously walked through the forest and we were looking around just to try and see if we were able to find anything. Reason why I went in this direction is because I had gone this way the last time and there was this weird like witchcraft kind of thing, which is what I was actually looking for. Obviously when I had gotten to this direction, I had realized there was a couple items on the floor and the first thing that I picked up was this mixer. Uh, it's basically like a mini martini mixer and I'm shaking it around realizing there's something inside of it obviously. Removed the tape and decided to look inside. So once I popped open this mixer I realized that there was a note on the inside and I pulled out the note, I took a look at it and I ended up reading what it said and I was a little bit shocked because this is not the first time I've found something like this but it said something along the lines of, hope you're feeling lucky today. Now the weird thing is that this is not, like I said, the very first time I found something like this. Most common I found was a rabbit's foot. But the weird thing is what was also inside of this mixer was this little tiny head. I don't know what the hell it's from, but for some odd reason it was in there. And uh, I kind of put two and two together in previous experiences with Randonautica, we've often found uh, dismembered 
uh, rabbit's feet, not actual rabbits, but from like stuffed animals, but it always says the same thing. There's always a note that says, I hope you're feeling lucky today with a little happy face, smiley face. So at this point, I put the note and whatever back in the mixer and I start deciding to head back towards where Brad was. So after continuing on to look for the witchcraft object, which I obviously couldn't find, I did find a random Tim Hortons coffee cup. And if you guys had seen in the most recent video on the vlog channel, we did actually find two uh, Tim Hortons coffee cups. One was actually full and it was totally liquid, which is kind of odd considering it is below freezing outside pretty much every day right now. Um, probably gonna be that way up until like April is what it is. But um, yeah, it just shows us that obviously somebody had been there recently and we don't know, maybe somebody's just littering, going around the forest, we have absolutely no idea. I just find it really odd that we keep on finding these Tim Hortons coffee cups and they're always full of liquid tea or coffee in them. I don't know if it means anything, but it just seems really kind of out of place to me. So I did continue on looking for that random witchcraft looking thing throughout the forest. Unfortunately, I could not figure out where the heck it went. Uh, maybe it had been destroyed by somebody else or an animal or maybe it just got buried in the snow and you, you just couldn't see exactly where it was. I have no idea. Um, and then we decided to basically carry on. Did you find anything? Yeah, so I found another note. Um, Where was the said, note? I thought you found a it flashlight. It was inside the flashlight. So I really? picked up the flashlight. I figure like, oh, it'll be kind of heavy. Maybe yeah. the battery compartment. And then I'm like, okay, there's no batteries in it. But then I started jingling. And I'm like, yeah. there's something in there. I, I thought like, okay, it could probably just be debris. It's an old thing. Yeah. I open it up and it just said that, um, help me, I am lost. Oh. Can you come find me? Which is weird because I found like that mixer thingy back there and it said something weird too. I don't even yeah. remember what the hell it said. But... Well, and this time I just got a letter. It just yeah. says E. So I can't find this stupid thing that I was looking for. Yeah. I think it might actually be back this way. And okay, we just yeah. kind of well, let's check it out, passed I do want it. To see it. Yeah. yeah. Let's see. It's here somewhere. It might just be buried in the snow. <laughs> So I do know that there's a little fence somewhere. It should be like right here. Where'd it go? No, just just no? the thing over there. Yeah. Dude. Is it a statue? Hey, it? No, it, it was like a. You would know exactly like when you. It was here. It was literally right here, and it's gone. Oh. So somebody either destroyed it or removed it for some odd reason. Can you um, give me a hint? I'll have to show you in the other video. It was like this witchcraft. It looked like a witchcraft thingy. Like just the oh. way it was kind of set up sticking out of the ground. Yeah. I don't know. It just seemed very odd to me. So I don't know. So, maybe this is. And I don't know what. Uh, which area? I don't it know. could be. I have no idea. It but I don't know what the deal is with like the fence over here too. Like it doesn't even go all the way across. It literally just goes right there. And then that it just stops. I, but I the thing was like here somewhere. I swear every time we go to some of these forests, like, <coughs> the Excuse me. changes, like, yeah. things change, and oh, then yeah. all of a sudden we're kind of like, yo, like, this is totally different, and now, like, you know yeah, what I and mean? Then we're, and then we're stuck wondering, like, what the hell is going on. Yeah, exactly. Right? So, all right, let's get back to the main trail. Because <sighs> the point is much further up. My point... <sighs> Wait, I thought I saw lights. Hang on. There's a light over there. Oh, that I was seeing something, but I wasn't sure. Yeah. I don't know if that's coming from a house or whatever. Okay. I know that this is deep forest, though. So, like, even if they were kind of way, way back ago, this forest is actually massive. You could get lost in here. <laughs> Okay, back on the uh, main trail. What is this? Dude, check this out. <laughs> yeah, somebody made their own, like yeah, somebody literally made their own cane. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, bend over. <laughs> no, no, I'm just... <laughs> Okay, nothing uh, behind there. All right. Carry on. Look, there's footprints that go that way. 
Yeah, I'm sure there's like a silo thing. I could see it off in the distance. I, I came here once during the day, and I'm like, oh, that looks interesting. What well, was it? I don't like know. This? It just looked like a big, like, concrete structure. Yeah. It kind of looked abandoned, but I can't remember if it's in this direction. It looks like people have gone that way, so. I mean, we can check it out. Maybe. Not that far. Yeah. Maybe afterwards. Let's go to our point for now, and then we'll see. Oh, so icy. People look like people have gone this way too. The hell? Yeah, so on my channel I get a lot of yeah. We actually talk quite a bit. She's Wait, really cool. Hello? I thought I heard something down there. Oh my god, dude. What the heck stop? Well, at least we have the day oh look! Oh what the f check this out. Yeah. This was here last time. It's still here. Yeah. Seek, seek and you will find. And then it's got a bunch of weird like calculations that make absolutely no sense whatsoever. Two, two, six. Are you... Oh wait, all you need are answers. Yeah. And there was like this thing stuck to it, and there was like something really spooky. I don't, I don't even want to talk about it, because yeah. that was just messed up. I don't need my anxiety to be fired up. Yeah. Okay. Every time it snows here, the forest changes. Whew. Wait, what was that? Yo, I see that too. What the hell is that? See what? I thought I heard something. What do you see? Oh, you, oh, I thought you said that you saw it. There's something in the tree over there to the left. Oh. Yeah. What is that? I don't know. What Yo, the hell? What is that? Another comic book. A comic book. That's cool. What the hell? Yeah, but it's kind of ominous. I mean, like, that looks like a dead body. Is it? Ooh. Yeah, like under the ground. I've actually... That's spooky. What the hell? Wait. I think I saw something move down there. Hello? Yeah. What the hell? Wait, I just heard something growl. What is going on? I've been finding comic books and that seems to be Brad. going intense. I heard something growl. Yeah. So I don't like something growled like on this side, but I don't I don't see anything. Okay. Um Are you good? Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I know, but I heard something. I just, I didn't know if we were about to be, like, attacked. I just wanted to, like, you know, kind of have you mentally prepared yeah, before, yeah, no, <laughs> we, before we get assassinated by, like... <laughs> yeah, it sounded like it was from on this side. I don't know. I'm not sure. Like, what kind of animals do we have out here that would growl other than, like, maybe coyotes? Well, we do. We actually do have wolves. Yeah. I didn't know that oh, okay. Until later that might on. make sense. Um, because it kind of sounded like a. Ur, ur. It was like awesome. It sounds like a kind bear. of this distance. <laughs> well, let's just hope we don't get attacked by a bear. Okay. Hey, what is that? You see that? There's something there. Yeah, something in the tree. There's something shiny down there, too. Okay, so we've run into audio issue number two, which is why we're doing this once again. Um, so at this point, we noticed these two things in the snow and something hanging on the tree. So of course, I approach. 
I take a look at what's on the ground. It looks sort of like these two little chalices. They're just kind of sitting there in the snow. No idea what, why they're there, but this is Randonautica. Things obviously get very strange and weird. Um, the weirdest part is what we found on the tree. I approached, I took a look at it, and realized that it's basically a religious object. And below the religious object, lo and behold, we find a keychain with my name on it, which is pretty shocking well enough. Now the scariest part is that after a few moments, I heard something kind of behind us. So I turned around, took a look, and I just saw these two lights coming towards us pretty quickly. So I warned Brad and we kind of started running off into the bush um, to where we could most likely hide. We got very, very low and basically covered our lights as best as we could from our cameras and just hoped and prayed that they wouldn't see us. They eventually did walk past us, um, which was good, but here is that footage. ceremony did you see those glasses i have no idea glasses those those chalices oh yeah you're right the chalices i don't know names on there dude my name is on that thing that's why i heard something coming and i started running i'm like what the f it just like that was just really weird and then i looked and i just saw lights coming and i'm like what are you that? running into cultists or something I, I don't what yeah we'll get to that i'll ex i'll explain after but <sighs> Keep your light low, because I don't know where they went. I don't know. I didn't even get a good look at it. Oh, what, what the f***? What is that? I don't know. It says something. We see all. We see you. Did you hear that thump? What was that? Just be very, very careful. Yeah. We see all. We see you. Come to the light. Come to us. We are the light. We are the way. We are all. Sons of Viserion. Oh, f off. come on. It's a cult. Okay. It's a cult. Yeah. Uh, so, do you remember when I explained about the Viserion? Usually, it's like, it's a cult. A it, this. It's this dude from Russia who literally thinks he's Jesus. And they have been coming after us non stop for months now. 
and it is getting a little bit freaky because they want us to join. They've Are been they dangerous? very. I've been getting threatening messages from them. And then there's been somebody recently who's been telling me to like avoid these people. And apparently we're looking for some person named Tom. Hence the reason why I ran the intent Tom. Because that's who we're supposed to be looking for. Yeah. What is this thing here? It's like a... It's like a, like a religious thing. Because, dude, these people think they're legit. They legit think they like... Think that they're gone. He thinks that he's the reincarnation of Jesus. And just the fact that they have, like, something with my name on it here, like... That's scary, dude. Dude, these guys need to f*** off. Are they gone? I hope so. They went, so we, we saw them go up that way. Yeah. I don't know where to go, though. I, I, uh, I don't me know neither. I don't know. Well, it seems like they've left, so I think we can maybe just keep going. Like, I'm not hearing any footsteps. I don't know. I mean, maybe they were just hikers and just it was kind of coincidence, but I don't know. Yeah, I know. So that's why I'm kind of like, I think we're okay. But it did look like they were looking for something. Or maybe they were just observing and they just had flashlights. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I mean that could be it. That could be it, right? This is this is this is This is something. Good. That I don't that I don't like. That's and then we got those two things, like you said, that's uh that's a little weird, but okay. Um I say we just maybe keep going for a little bit. I don't even think we've made it to any of our points yet. Because yeah. I think yours was a little further up than mine. Yeah, I can't remember. I, I think it was back there. Yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> My anxiety just has me. Yeah. I, like, I honestly didn't know that the seriousness of this whole cult thing. I mean, I, I've heard you talk about. Yeah, it. dude. No, I'm no. Not this really is like this is some serious stuff. Like I've spoken to the cops about it, and yeah. like it's it's rough. It's rough. It's uh, definitely spooky. So okay, but I am also at the same time kind of ready to kick some ass tonight if, yeah, if it comes I to it. If, if, if I get the to, opportunity, I'm not. I have no problem doing that, so I just don't know who the hell these jabronis were. We chased that person before. So. Yeah. All right, whatever. I guess we'll uh, keep going. Where the hell did they even come from, though? I don't even know. Mm -hmm. All right, whatever. Uh, it looks like there's footprints like all around here. You see that? Yeah, it's like they're. That's not the trail though. The trail keeps going that way. Well, we keep seeing footprints off trail. Like I mean, look at these. Yeah. 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 Yeah, Maybe no, that's for sure. The light a little bit. Or? Yeah, I think we're okay now. I don't see anything. Let me get my uh, my torch light so we can actually see down there. I know. Yeah, no, they're they're gone, dude. They're they're totally gone. You're oh better. God. You hot, you're like a rabbit, man, with your ears. Like you can hear <sighs> sounds. Well, I'm used to it from years of ghost hunting. At this point, yeah, yeah. I'm uh, I'm a little susceptible to like noticing like little sounds. Yeah. And plus, I do have most of my hearing all back after being sick with a cold for oh, a little that's while. Good. <laughs> all right, let's uh, let's carry on. I just got to change this battery because I think it's getting a little low. Yep, no problem. All right. Okay, so we have audio malfunction number three in this footage, and this one's definitely a little bit weird. So we're kind of searching around. We're obviously hearing strange noises throughout the woods. At this point, we don't know if they're animals, if they're human. We have no idea. So we continue on. Um, heading towards my point at this uh, at this point and basically we start to notice that there's a bunch of footsteps that kind of lead off onto the side of the trail it's not even on the trail it's like a weird side trail that somebody created so at this point I do notice that there's obviously these two sets of footprints one kind of going left one kind of going right as if they had just come out from this direction uh, which is kind of odd to say the least so we de decide we're gonna follow these footsteps and we find this divot in the snow. It looked almost as if two people had just recently been sitting there. And the weird part is that we find this odd object of basically like MacGyvered pipes all put together almost as if it was some weird candle holder. Go figure, because there was candles in them, um, which is obviously strange. Uh, the other thing that we end up finding was this weird angel thing. and. Uh, you guys will see in a, in a second exactly what happens with this. What is that? I don't know. Is this a statue? Looks like it. Oh, dude. Where's the head? Uh, back where we were, like towards the beginning of the trail. Yeah. There was the silver thing that I found. Yeah. 
had this exact same tape and the head was in there. Oh my God. Yeah. So we gotta be very, very careful. Uh, yeah. You're telling me. Now have you come in contact with these with oh yeah this like elsewhere like uh, there's the there's been yeah dude this started oh, like in God. texas no joke like this started on like the other side of the continent that's the crazy like part followed, dude, I, I, oh no that's that's a guarantee that i already know and we constantly check the car for trackers we never find any so these cultists like, what, like if you don't join them what will they kill you like, oh. I, I don't understand. oh i don't know anything about this dude that thing that's a message from them. What? 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 That thing. That, that says, we just want to be friends with you, J.S. Oh Which I'm assuming is John Smith. That's like the, one of their like contact people. I don't know. I'm, oh my God. <laughs> yeah. And then you said oh. what, the, the leader's name is Tom? No. Is no, dude. This is like one confusing ass story, but yeah. um, yeah. I'm just glad it's not me. No, their, their, their leader's office. name, his actual name is Sergey. Okay. Um, he's from Russia, and he goes by Visarian or Visarian or whatever. Yeah. And they apparently started a commune, and they're trying to start other communes. And it's like they're trying to get us to join their commune so they can, I guess, kind of, like, expand. And I don't know why they want us or what it has to do with Randonautica, but for some reason, whenever we do Randonautica, we end up finding more and more clues from them. And it doesn't make any sense we've told them no multiple times and they just keep coming and coming and coming they will not take no for an answer and it's just it's freaky and clearly there was two people just sitting here as if they were almost waiting for us to come through here they obviously think that good you, thing they're gone though yeah, it looks they, like they've left they so. obviously think that you're very smart that you you could bring your skills and no, no, no I, I ain't joining no cult, okay? I know, I know that. Roman know Catholic that. at just... birth, and that's how it's gonna stay. Yeah. I'm Christian um, myself, so... Yeah, I'm not I'm not dealing with these guys. This dude is not the real Jesus. Um, <sighs> what the f***, man? Okay. So my intent is to the right. It is? Like, yeah, further yeah. up? So this is Jen's... Uh, uh, yeah. So this is mine that was run up this way. Almost like Siberia, Russia kind of thing. Like freezing, freezing. Cold. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> Oh man, the weather's been brutal, that's for sure. It's been cold, it's been snowy, everything's turning to ice. Here I am, you know, we, could, we stopped me at a nice place to eat. And with me, hot caffeine gets my anxiety going even worse. I'm super Whoa. hyper, super anxious. Look at all these trees, dude. All just been cut down, it looks like, for some reason. Whoa, what was that? Or it's something. It says that mine's up here. Um, I believe it's on the left hand side. The left? Yeah, but it's up further. Yo. Like, you mean What's here? That? Yeah, there's something there. What am I looking at? I don't know. That looks like a photo. There's something hanging on the tree. I'll see what that is, but it's like some sort of photo, guys. So it's like their faces are distorted and cut apart. And it looks like a... Happy birthday, Michael, 1994. Oh my Happy God. birthday, Michael? Okay, Who's so Michael? Long story short, Michael is a person that w became of interest to us. He went by the name Magic Man. And this is something that I brought up to you oh, earlier. Oh, I remember that, yeah. I remember we found like We some... actually found the name of this dude. What the f*** was that? And his name's Michael. Wait, shh, shh, shh. I just heard something. Oh, 
Hello? Anything. Maybe it was just a tree falling over or an animal or something. I definitely want what the to heck see is this thing? This. I don't know, dude. I'm gonna check it out. It looks like there's just a bunch of letters and things on here. I don't really know what to make it out. It looks like some sort of UFO image. But anyways, they all worked at MUFON, which is Mutual UFO Network. Okay. And people actually have to pay monthly to be in this thing. Really? I'm wearing the hat that was supposedly Charlie's. That we found in that, you know that abandoned house we were So in. you found that hat? Oh, I found yeah, that in the okay, house I remember that. With all the luggage yeah, and stuff. Yeah. And I've been putting, I've been wearing the hat because I'm hoping that if somebody sees me, they'll be like, oh, a mm. member of my group. Because this whole group were separated. And we assumed that there was mal, malintent. I keep hearing something down there. Hello? Somebody down there? Okay, that was just an animal. So maybe that's what that knocking was? <laughs> that was weird. Okay. I was gonna see, would you would you be able to hold my camera too? Um I just found this thing. I wanna see what it not is. Not really, I kinda want both hands just in okay. case to be honest. Um with you. I think I might be able to prop it. There's a tree here, because I just wanna yeah. see what this thing is. Just hopefully it doesn't fall over or anything. Like yeah, because I'm hearing a lot of weird things, so I got one hand on the flashlight and one hand on the camera. Okay. No, I got a prop good, so we're fine. I'm going to see what this thing is. It's Insta something. Oh my god. What? It's another micro cassette tape. What the f***? It says... You found a lot of those, didn't you? Yeah, it says happy birthday, and then there's the upside down M with the top hat. What does that mean? That's Michael's initial for Magic Man. Oh. That's creepy. There's a USB. Obviously, I can't do anything. Oh, shit. Yeah, okay. Computer. I remember when we found one of those before, too. Luckily, this time, I actually brought the uh, the player, because the first time, I didn't bring it, because I didn't ass I didn't think I was going to find anything yeah. else. Yeah. So you I just keep your cassette player on you? I mean, it makes sense, because um, you continually keep finding these things, right? So I actually thought that the, the trail had gone cold. So the last <coughs> few videos, I didn't bother bringing it, because I just figured, okay, well, mm -hmm. this is over, this is done, like, whatever it was, was what it was. But anyways... Uh. I guess we'll just give this thing a rip and see what it is. I'm just eared out though, dude, because there's something, there's something eerie going on. Many people don't know what it is. I keep so, hearing something from this direction. I was hearing sounds too, like it's just odd, dude. I don't know what I it don't was. see a single something thing. Sounded <laughs> like a, something sounded like a wolf. Yeah. But anyways, uh, this lighting is alright. So guys, this is the, uh, this is another tape that I found. I'm very eared out to play this because I don't know what it could be. Was that? I don't know, dude. <laughs> Are you kidding me right now? I don't know what to make of that. That voice was creepy. I heard that laugh before. I know. I can't remember where, but I'm pretty sure I've heard that before. That is so messed up, bro. So okay. messed up. Well, uh, what I don't know. Down there? I have no idea. I keep hearing something knocking. It could be nothing. It could literally just be animals, but. I don't feel safe here. That's for sure. No, this place is a little sketchy. I don't feel safe here. Well, we are here to investigate, see what the hell is going on over here, so... Yeah, I know. I'll go. Uh, I think maybe we'll keep going and see if we see find we anything. Get, right? Yeah. Huh. 
<sighs> they're gonna change my battery again. <laughs> Damn it. Is your battery okay? Yeah. No, I, I just put it. I didn't realize I put like an almost dead one. It's already flashing. So oh, I'll just change it real quick. And then, check? Yeah, I'm going to just change it real quick. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Already good to go. Just switching uh, flashlight hands. Okay. So, we didn't get to either of our points, I don't think. Our points are still way ahead of this. Yeah. Well, just keep looking around. We'll see if we can find any more clues. Um, just, yeah, keep your eyes open if you see anything. Oh, dude, this is like... <sighs> I don't even know, man. I don't know what's going on half the time. Let me do this. Yeah, it could have... Yeah, it was either like an animal. It could have also just been like a tree, like rubbing against another tree or something. Or like maybe there's ice on some of the tree. I have no idea. It doesn't look like it, but who knows. All I know is it's cold, it's snowy, um, but we're out here, <laughs> so. <sighs> hey, I'm not seeing anything anymore. We found a bunch of stuff, but now it's just like the trail's gone dead. Thousands. Oh my god. Yeah, at some point they definitely had thousands of people. Um, he's in jail apparently at the okay, moment. Well, I honestly I don't know if he ever got out. That was just like the last piece of news. That was a few years ago. So um oh, it's just a snow mound. I thought I saw something down there. Okay. There's footprints here. Yeah, I know. You keep seeing these footprints like off trail, and it's like, who the hell would would leave? You know what I mean? I don't even know, dude. We've got wolves and coyotes in, in Canada, and if you if you go off trail, they still hunt you too. Well, the coyotes are not so bad. Um, you just don't really want to catch them hungry in a large pack. Yeah. And then let them surround you. But we do have a secret weapon, so okay. <laughs> I'll just blind them if they come after us. Yeah, no, it's uh, it's really good. <sighs> yeah, this look, there's more footprints this way, but that looks like an animal. Yeah, that I definitely think. looks like an animal. So maybe that's just what we were hearing. Yeah. <sighs> yep. this uh, battery a little bit and turn it up slightly. Uh, what the f*** is that? Bro! Dude. Holy f***! Okay, okay. What the f***? right there. 
I see him. I see him. What in the actual dude? Are you okay? Oh my god. Dude, I thought I thought there was a dead body. Oh my good lord. Just stay with me. Stay with me. Oh my god. Where'd he go? Where did he go? Trust is still. Holy. Oh my god. Dude, it was a person. Dude, he's right there. I see his light. I see you coming. Oh god. Not this again. What the f***? No, there's a person. He's coming. Hey man, go screw yourself. What the f***? This guy, man. Dude. Okay. I don't know. Hey! Get the f back! Stay the f away from us! We need to get the f out of here. Let's go. I don't know. I know. Just be careful. I thought I heard something. Okay. Who are these people? I don't know. I don't know. It's so icy. Okay. Okay. What the f Is he there or? I don't care about the f***ing planes, dude. Who the f*** is this guy? I don't know. Is that one of these Arsanian things? <laughs> Maybe. I I had a blue robe on, dude. Oh, I just noticed there's a Tim Hortons cup. So basically at this point we once again lost our audio, but um, it's pretty self-explanatory. We are basically following this trail, trying to get ourselves out of this forest as quick as possible. Whoever this person was kept coming towards us again and again and again. They would literally not back off. This person had a random stick in their hand. Um, and they were basically taunting us with it. We were telling them to back off. And honestly, I don't even know how else to explain this. This, this was just freaking crazy. We have no idea who the hell this person was, but it was pretty obvious that they were waiting for us there. Um, it kind of looks like we got set up. I don't know by who. Um, it's just weird. It's just really, really scary. But we kept going and going and going, and this person just kept coming at us from behind. So I'm turning to the front, I'm telling Brad to watch ahead of him. I'm turning to the back, looking to check what's what's basically behind us. Obviously, this person just keeps keeps on coming. Like they, they will not back off no matter how many times we told them to give us space and back off of us. But they, they just wouldn't do that. As we're going up this trail, at some point, Brad gets startled by something that obviously he sees in front of him, and I turn to look, and I'm like, what do you see? And I approach, and all of a sudden, there's just this big-ass dude literally just standing there, walking towards us slowly, and I just kind of panicked, and I'm like, dude, just run. Run as fast as you friggin' can, and we're running through the snow. It's really, really deep at this point. We turn off all of our lights. We get down, I basically like threw myself into a bush, which kind of sucked. And at this point, we can see that these people are basically looking around. They both have flashlights. You can tell that they're looking around. 
um, they're trying to, I guess, figure out where the hell we went, and we were fortunate enough that we managed to lose them, so they weren't able to find us there, and, uh, yeah, this is, uh, th this was one hell of an experience, to say the least. They can't, they don't, they can't see us. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I know, but they're like all the way down there. Let's just get on the trail. We're just gonna have to run. <sighs> Stupid thing, turn on. <sighs> what the f where'd they go? Okay, wait, let's just get the f out of here. Okay. What the f I don't care about my bag. The burrs, don't worry about the burrs. Oh man. I don't see anything. Okay, I think we might be okay. Dude, there's. F you don't think they want to kill us, do you? I don't want to f test it. No, we need light, dude. What if there's more? What if there's literally more of them? I don't know. You said there's thousands of them. Uh, yeah. <sighs> what the hell? What is that? Okay, that's weird. <sighs> Just keep an eye behind you. <sighs> huh? I dimmed my light just a bit so that it's... Yeah. Okay. I think we... Did you see the size of that guy? Dude, that guy was huge. He was massive. Like... Muscle. Pure muscle. Dude. Oh my god. Okay, I think... I think we're getting there. Holy crap. Right? But dude, the problem is like we don't know if like these guys have weapons. <sighs> okay. I think we're almost at the entrance. <sighs> Burrs, man. <sighs> Stuck to my gloves. I think there might be somebody there. What? I thought I saw someone there. Yeah, Come on, turn on. <sighs> don't worry about the burrs, dude. Just keep your eyes open. Look behind you. <sighs> okay, there's no one here. <sighs> Holy moly. <sighs> Dude, what the f is that? What, what, you see something? There's something at the entrance. It's not a person, is it? No. I don't think so. Just give me a second. Let me make sure there's no one here. <sighs> keep your keep your eyes behind you too. Just keep checking just in case. <sighs> yeah, there's like a I don't know what this I don't know. What the hell?
Okay. It's a Polaroid. Dude, there's a Polaroid. That's an old camera. You see this thing? Yeah. What is this? Yo. There's like what? something on it, bro. <coughs> oh my god. So we found this stuff coming back to the car, guys. Dude, I'm kind of like nervous or somebody who's... I know. What if there's somebody that? forward? Like this is... This is what's planted to be. Turn on, come on. This looks like a woman's sweater here. Okay, that's just really weird. And shoes. It looks like there was something shoved in the camera. What is that, a necklace? <sighs> yeah, like... Dude, check this out. It's a Catholic... It's a Catholic necklace with like the Mother Mary oh, or something Oh dude, on you it. gotta be kidding me right now. Dude, if there's missing people, like, these people could have abducted them. Oh, I, I'm not even kidding you. I don't even know about that, but I'm just saying the... The fact that there's Mother Mary on that, that's obviously a religious yeah. necklace, so... What is that? This here, I found this, it was on top, it was on the freaking Polaroid! Okay, just let me put the camera here, so... I'm sorry guys, I'm shaky, I can't hold the camera right Just be right quick now. man, be quick. Okay, so... We gotta get the hell out of here. Right now. I just found this. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna just look this way. And it says, oh, man. "Take a picture. It will last longer of my dead body." That is what? star seed. Are no you... joke, dude. We just found this. Look at that. What the f okay, that's that's whack. Okay, we gotta get the hell out of here, dude. Get the hell out of here. We gotta get moving, guys. We can't stay here. There's stuff going on. I don't know. Hey, let's, go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Don't worry. Grab the camera. Let's go. I think so. Alright, let's just get to the car and get out of here. Let's go. Okay. Alright. That's it. I'm done. I am done. <laughs>